guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's scene is a little different. I'm sitting on the floor in my bedroom and I'm enjoying a glass of red wine, Scout and Cellar red wine. So in today's video, I'm talking about my top seven favorite Amazon designer dupes. Now we are gonna be talking about items that are for the most part that are similar to the designer but not ripping the designer off. I do not believe in ripping anyone off or stealing something directly from a designer and we're gonna kind of start with that. So I'm sharing seven things. The first thing is something actually that is sort of ripping off a brand and we're gonna talk about why that is so because the first thing is a Gucci belt, right? This is a faux, not the real Gucci belt. They're not saying they're Gucci though. So this is the one thing where I bought this belt a while ago and I got a little bit of, I guess you would say, negative feedback but I can link similar belts like this for you. Like they have a lot of really cute ones out there that just have circles. So it's not copying a logo. So I wanna find things that are inspired by a designer, right? Like they're not copying the exact pattern. They're not copying the exact logo. They're not like putting the logo on their stuff. They're inspired by them. So that's this whole video today. I'm sharing my top favorites. The first one is probably one of my favorites and I've had these sunglasses forever now, like maybe two years. So these are my real Karen Walker sunglasses. I'm gonna show them to you guys. Here they are in their glory. They're beautiful. They make my face look great. It's just like, bam, love them so much. I get nervous about wearing them around my kids sometimes and like having my daughter play with them or taking them to the beach because they're like 250 bucks. So I wanted to find a lookalike. Now these are from Amazon and they're very similar. Okay, so like the tortoise vibe is a little different color wise, but other than that, like they're so, so similar. And then they also have them in black. So here's the black, but do you see how similar they are? I mean, I love these so much. Here we go. Okay, so this is a little different color on the whole tortoise aspect, but these glasses are $9.99 a piece, or you can get the two pack, so both of them for $17.99. And I love that, like I can go to the beach, throw these in my bag, not stress out, like they're amazing. It's like getting to look for less. They're not exactly, you know, the same exact thing. The Karen Walker ones have these little arrows on the side. These obviously don't have that. The tortoise coloring is a little different, but the style is very much the same. So like there's, you know, things about it that are the same, things about it that are different. And you know, it's kind of like, to me, it's getting to look for less. And these are like the best. Like tried and true, a bunch of my Instagram followers have bought them, love them too. So those are like my number one. That's what I wanted to start the show with. Okay, so number two, I don't have the real thing for all these, by the way, because I'd be like, you know, loaded if that was the case. But anyways, next one. Does this ring a bell to you guys? This is Gucci inspired. So it's not a knockoff. It's not saying Gucci on it. It's not the exact same thing. It's Gucci inspired, in my opinion. I mean, there's, it's like the Gucci Dinos. I don't even know how to pronounce it. I don't own it. It's like thousands and thousands of dollars, like two or 3,000. But this, to me, reminds me of like a Gucci style bag, and I love it. It's beautiful. Like, it's a little more higher priced on Amazon, but it's real up here. You know, this is like the real deal. So that's why it smells so good. I have some stuff in here. Ooh, my peppermint essential oil that I've been looking for. That's really good for bad breath. Anyways. There's some stuff in here. So there's two little sections in here and there's a zipper section in the middle and then there's also like a section in the front for cards and stuff. And then there's also like a zip in the back. So it's like really nice for like storage of stuff. Oh, there's a tampon. You know, <laughs> I did just use this bag. So it's so cute. Like it's seriously so beautiful. Like if you follow me on Instagram, you've definitely already seen this, but it's seriously beautiful. They have it in multiple colors. They have it in like different prints, patterns. I love it. I also love this. You can make it like full length like this. So if you want to wear it as like, you know, one, or you can do as like this more on your shoulder. It's beautiful. So beautiful. Love that so much. <sighs> smells great. It's real. You know, there's real leather right there. Okay, so next, actually this is from Amazon too. You guys have definitely seen this. I have talked about this pullover a million times, but it's not necessarily like a designer dupe, it's just kind of like a pullover. So I will link this for you guys too. Next up, David Yurman lookalike bracelet, okay? I don't have the real David Yurman, it's just not something I own, but this is very similar to a David Yurman style. Like I have to come up a little bit closer here. So it has like the little crystals on like the bottom. It's a lot thinner though than a David Yurman bracelet. I can tell you that because I have seen David Yurman bracelets and they're thicker. This is pretty thin, but if you want to get the look for less and you don't want to spend a ton of money, this is very affordable. For me, like if I'm going to wear bracelets, I'm going to wear like my watch with it. Um, I used to work at a Pandora jewelry store a while ago and I would wear like my leather bracelet and then like little bracelets like this kind of like stacked. I think that's a really cute look. Look. So if you're trying to get like the stacked look, you could get like multiple of these and kind of have that effect. So this is probably one of my favorite like jewelry dupes because I really like David Yurman, but it can be expensive, right? So 
This is a great option. That's kind of like an orange color jewel in the end. All right, next up is two Chloe inspired bags that I love so much. This was the first one that I actually got on Amazon, like the first like designer inspired bag right here. I love it. Now it's not saying Chloe on it. It's not exactly the same. I think the Chloe bag is completely gold here and it says Chloe right here. And this is a, you know, replica and it's gold here with silver. So it's a little bit of silver, a little bit of gold. The gold's not super strong, so it almost looks like a little silvery. It's like a two-tone vibe, but I love this bag like so much. Goodnight Macaroon is a boutique that also makes some like bags that look like this, but they're not as good. I have one and the hardware is not as good. It just doesn't look as nice as this one. I love this one so much. And on the inside, there's a few different areas. There's like the middle area, then there's two, three, Four. So there's quite a bit of storage inside. Oh, my floss pick is in there. What else do I got in there? Oh, a winery thing. Mm, okay. I love this bag. Like I seriously love it. It comes, so they have this in the larger size and I believe this is the smaller size, but they have, you know, like the Chloe bag that's a little bigger that looks like this. They have that as well on Amazon. I've seen other bloggers wear it and it's beautiful. So I will link both. This looks, you know, pretty similar. I mean, the hardware is not gonna be as good as the real thing. I don't own the real bag, so I can't show it to you guys, but I've seen them and they are so stunning. But I feel like this is a very good option. If you're on a budget and you don't wanna spend money on the real thing, I think this is okay. And the next Chloe inspired bag I have is this backpack. This is my favorite. I love this. Everything's my favorite, right? Um, no, but I really love this. And the gold is a little bit more gold on this, as you can tell. And obviously it pops from the black. Now this is a little backpack that you can also wear like over your shoulder. You can use this strap. I love to wear it like that. It's super easy. It's so cute. Or if you want to do a backpack, the back has obviously the backpack straps. You could take those off too if you don't want that, but... I think it's great to have the option to do both. And then this is very much two-toned because the little clasp here is silver. It's kind of hard to tell on camera. And then this is gold, and then this part is gold, and then the hardware on the back is gold. I love it. I can go on for days about how much I love this bag. And it has a really good area in the back here for storage, and then also like a little area in the front. So it has like two different sections. And then this part in the front sort of just unzips. Like it doesn't really do anything. It just kind of has that little look. Like you can have it unzipped in the front like that, or you can, I'm not good at product videos where like hold stuff. This is like my second time doing this. Or you can zip it back up like that. So once again, it's not saying it's Chloe, like, you know, it doesn't say Chloe on here. It's not exactly similar, but it is pretty close if you wanna get the look for less. I don't think anyone's gonna be like, well, they might be like, oh, that's a Chloe bag. And you're like, oh no, girl, I got it on Amazon. Looks like it, but it's not it, you know? So that's gorgeous. Okay, next up, we're gonna talk about Louis Vuitton. Now this is my real Louis Vuitton never full bag. I actually just purchased one of these. I'm 34 and I've never bought like a high end designer bag. I just never felt like I needed one, but recently I decided to buy one because I'm gonna actually do a video coming up probably in the next two weeks, next week or two, where I'm going to show you guys this one versus some similar ones. But what I did get on Amazon was a Louis Vuitton inspired wallet. Now here they are, so cute. And I'm gonna show you guys. So I got a wallet with my Louis Vuitton bag, right? So this is the real deal here. This actually comes inside of the bag. So I wanna show you guys the difference between this one and then this Amazon one. Now you can tell the coloring is different, right? Like this is almost more of a purple coloring, the real one. This is more of like a dark navy, like black. So there's some differences there. Also, this one doesn't say Louis Vuitton on it because they're not advertising as Louis Vuitton. They're not saying they're Louis Vuitton, which is good. We don't want that. This one is the real one. It says Louis Vuitton Paris on it. Now there are people who make ones that probably say Louis Vuitton Paris. They literally are copying off of them. You know, don't buy those. <laughs> Not cool. This one is similar, right? It has a little bit of a darker look here. It doesn't say Louis Vuitton on it, but I mean, it's a way to get the look for less. I got this on Amazon for like 16 bucks and it has quite a few compartments in it and it has areas for cards too. Kind of hard to tell here, but there is a ton of areas and there's also like a change area in the middle. I love this. I think this is very cute. This one here like is just, they have like one section here and then one section in the middle. So it's a little less. This isn't necessarily trying to be like this. There's a wallet from Louis Vuitton that looks more similar to this. It has more space inside. It's kind of more like this, but this is just the knockoff kind of version of that. I don't have that. So I just want to show you guys my real one and like kind of how they're similar, but different. See, you can tell there's a bit of a difference in coloring. So. That's that. I literally think those are like 16 bucks on Amazon. Anyways, so this is really cute. It's a great way to get the look for less. They also have it in the brown color. Now I don't have the brown one here to show you. 
but you know, I can tell it's not the real thing. It doesn't say Louis Vuitton on it, obviously, and it just looks a little bit different. I don't have the real one, but the coloring looks off too. Same kind of style on the inside with all the storage. I just got these in, so I haven't had a chance to use them, but I found them on Amazon and I was like, okay, I gotta show them. So I will link everything that I talked about here in the video. I'm obsessed with my new bag. I will be doing a video on this. The real deal here. And then I'm gonna compare it to some other bags that are kind of similar, but a little bit different, but they still have that vibe. Yeah, I guess that's it. That was pretty quick. That went really fast. So anyways, if you guys have any questions about any of these items, leave it in the description box down below. I will definitely link all of them for you guys so you can find them. This I will link to, this is so cozy. I think I sized up to a medium in this. It's so comfy. It's also from Amazon. So yeah, if you guys have any questions or if you guys wanna request videos next, I love when you guys do that. I have some really good ones coming up soon from Amazon. I have like, like I said, a Louis Vuitton. I have a try on. I'm gonna be doing some spring stuff soon. I need lots of things. So definitely hit the subscribe button if you guys aren't subscribed. I do these kind of videos where I like share all my favorite things. I do a lot of try-ons too and then I also do like family vlogs. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. Where you move, make me blind. You will always be there. There's no doubt in my mind. You will always be there. Heading out to see ya and leave the rest behind.